What's up guys, Grim here. Today we're talking about some Elder Scrolls Online and the Dragon Bones DLC has just been released today. And naturally, with anything like this, it seems like companies can never seem to release a DLC or an expansion without there being some bugs that gets through. So you can't really blame them. I mean, nobody has been able to uh, get by with a major update like this without there being some problems along the way. Unfortunately for the Elder Scrolls Online, this was kind of a big one. This was where players were going into dungeons and they were not gaining any experience at all whenever they were in there. Now, whenever I did my dungeon run, I barely squeaked in a, a fang layer run before the servers had went down. I barely finished in time. Right at the end of it, there was like the 15 minute warning before the servers were going down. You can watch the video. I posted it. And, oh man, I would have been so upset if it would have went down before I had beat the last boss. Because that would have been a lot of work that actually just went all, all away. And that would have been very discouraging. But we got through it and got some loot. And I guess we wasn't gaining any experience. I did not notice it at the time because I was so focused on boss mechanics. I was also uh, paying a lot of attention to the artwork that was in that dungeon like all the new stuff I wanted to see it so I did not even pay attention to the XP gains and apparently people were reporting that they wasn't gaining any experience at all so Bethesda had to take down the servers shortly after they would all they had only been up like just for a little bit I think maybe two hours or something uh, so yeah for them to turn around and take the servers down right after they had been down for a long time putting in the Dragon Bones DLC. Players were very upset about that. Well, naturally, whenever there is a bug in the game, it isn't always just that way. It's where players exploit it as well. Apparently, there was a way to uh, exploit the XP gains, uh, you know, the opposite side of the spectrum, to where you gain too much XP, and some players were exploiting it. So, over the next few days, Basically, Bethesda is going to go through those accounts and judge them on a case-by-case -case basis. The people that were obviously exploiting this as much as they could will probably receive a ban hammer, whereas people that unintentionally gained a little bit too much experience and didn't know what was going on will probably get a slap on the wrist or nothing happened at all. But it's going to be a case-by-case -case basis, so hopefully everybody gets judged fairly. Uh, if you learn one thing from this video, don't cheat the game because they can probably find you out whenever you do. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video guys. If you did, smash that like button. As usual, my name is Grim and I'll see you next time.